welcome to another Router Gods video. My name is Humphrey Chung, and in this video, we're going to make a new practice topology. We're going to take our three routers and form a triangle, and we're going to call this practice topology 5B. B is in Bravo. So first thing we want to do, we want to load in our old practice topology 5, and we're going to change a couple things. First, we're going to change the title. So we're going to call this practice topology 5B. And we'll say three routers in a triangle. If you don't know how to change the text, all you have to do is simply double click in the text and then you can edit it. Click out of there. And all you're going to need to do is take router two, move it up and move the loop back somewhere like over here. And we'll move router one down a little bit. And we'll do the same thing to router three. We're going to add a link between router 1 and router 3 by right-clicking router 1. Or actually, we're going to click on this add a link button right here. Left-click on router 1, click on fast 01. Left-click on router 3, fast 01 as well. Unclick add a link. And just to make things easier to see, click on this show interface names icon right there. And then you can move these interfaces, these labels, where you want. Okay, that looks pretty good. If you want, you can also import your configs from the old topology. So import from a directory and just find the folder that you popped your three router configs into. But for now, what we're going to do is we're going to save this topology, save the project, go up to File, Save As and then just save it to a folder of your choosing. Okay, now we have to configure routers one and three. So we're gonna fire up the routers. And then fire up our console windows. Okay, everything's up and running. We aren't going to be concerned about router 2, so I'm going to move that window over. So we're just going to configure router 1. Enable ConfT interface fast 01. That's the interface between router 1 and router 3. IP address. And you can see here our IP address is... Oh, we haven't labeled it. So I'm going to add some text by clicking the text box up here. We're going to make this link 101013x. X being the number of the router. I'm going to move this here. And obviously you would probably need to go up to file and save as again to save the updated config. Go back to router 1. IP address 101013.1. And that's a slash 24 mask. And remember to no shut. And then we're going to do a WR for write mem. I'm going to go back to router 3. I'm going to set up that interface as well. Enable ConfT interface fast 01 IP address 1010.13.3 that's a slash 24 mask. No shut. And with any luck we will be able to ping over to router 1. And we have a success, so I'm going to do a quick write mem, and then I'm going to save my configs. So I'm going to go up here to extract config, extract to a directory, click OK, and then you just basically find the directory you want to save to. I'm going to cancel out of there. So that was a quick and easy video of making practice topology 5B, that's three routers in a triangle. This is going to be very useful when you start studying RIP, EIGRP, OSPF, because this lets you play around with failover. And let's say you're on router one, you'll be pinging router three. So this would be the shortest path that it would take. You go over to router three, you shut down this interface, and you'll be able to see the routing protocols talk to each other and then send the traffic from router one and reroute it to router two 
over to router three. So it's a pretty interesting topology, very simple. All you're doing is you're taking the old topology and just making it into a triangle. Thanks for watching.